shopping haul, the, all this food underneath my feet should have been £61.93p. Oh God. And I paid £16.29p. So, I've separated it out this time into fruits, vegetables, starches, drinks and like snacky bits type of thing. Because someone had asked me what I had to give it in some form of order. Because it was all willy-nilly. No, it's in, it was in supermarkets. <laughs> yeah. Which is how we see it. Okay. So, fruit-wise. And my favourite buy from Asda. Mangoes. They are really hard. And we had to fight for them. Yes. And we got... They should be a pound. And I got them for 10p, as you can see. So... They're really hard, so they're just going to go in the fridge and slowly ripen, or I'll get them out when I want them ripening. So, But you haven't had mangoes for a while, so... No, I'll go... It's been months since I've had fresh mangoes like that. Normally, the way I've been getting mangoes, it's like this. Prepackaged. And she freezes them. Yeah, and... They make smoothies and so stuff. this one has mango, melon, and pineapple in, and I got it for 10p, which is a bargain. Okay. Tempe Floss Grapes, and I got these ones for 15p. The stickers came off onto this one for some reason. Normal Grapes, little pun at this time, 10p. I'll use them as a snack. Most of the fruit is either used as snacks or as breakfast items. Or smoothies. Or smoothies, which is... Two tubs of mixed berries. Uh, at one for my tea, too. Yep. 20p each. They should be about £2 each. And I would never pay £2 for this. Um, when we got to Tesco, we noticed these perfectly imperfect strawberries. They're just like really itty strawberries, but I paid 27p for them. So, not bad. They also had blueberries. I grabbed these for yeah. her. Should be £2, and I paid 50p each. Because I'm out of berries. Yeah. I've got absolutely no berries in, so I needed stuff. Uh, melon Melody. So it's just lots, man, of melon. lots of different types of melon. Again, perfect when I'm for mornings. Means I don't have to prep my food. Food. There's nothing in it. That's what you can do. Pears. 15p for a bag of kids' pears, but they're like snack pears to me, so during the day. And I've got a variety one of them as well. <sighs> Watermelon, 20p, should have been a pound. So, again, I just eat that whole for breakfast. A whole, pine, whole pineapple. With the cartoon count? Yep, 35p. So, it saves me half of the prep work. Mm, more bananas 10p a bag and they're at really good stages so yes you can't go wrong with bananas now it's on to all of my veggies we got the peppers so that'll be 50 whatever p what 50 something p after cash back so peppers are always good and i got them as well for we didn't know this was going to happen, otherwise we definitely wouldn't have bought two lots. Hi, samples. For 15p. 19p. Oh, 19p. In the reductions at Tesco, so I wasn't going to say no. Ah, peppers are peppers. Uh, Chantony carrots, 15p. I'll have these with like hummus or grate them into salads. Uh, stir fry medley. So there's spring onions there. Chili, broccoli, snap peas, and baby cauliflower. Corn, baby. Sweet corn. corn. Why am I thinking cauliflower? Uh, yeah, I'll use that in a curry. Tesco's Mediterranean roasting veggies. You could roast them, or these would be perfect to make ratatouille with. Ah, you could add that half of uh, aubergine you've got left from yeah. today. As that. Two bags of spinach. And she had to fight for that as well. Yeah, they. I've never seen someone grab for spinach so quickly. There was a full tub full and they literally were like, boom. I was like, <gasps> so I only wanted one, but I ended up grabbing two. So I was like, okay then, that's fine. Let's empty your bag, it's not good for it, the bag. No. Uh, British Little Gem 
10 p for lettuce. We've got none in. Have we? And we're finally out of lettuce. Yeah. And we didn't get the iceberg last week no. because we still had lettuce. So that's, I plan on doing burgers, so that'll be good. Now, end of the veg, but into the carbs. So, sort of. Sweet potatoes. And they should have been a hell of a lot more, but I paid 20p per bag, which is fantastic. Especially if you're just putting all some immoderations mm. and they were about 80 or p. Yeah. Um, I also picked up this polenta in Morrison's. I've never really had polenta, but at 43p. She I thought she'd have a plate. Yeah. Which is most of my recipes. Though I got asked today, are you a chef? Because I was explaining to a woman what I ate. And I was like, no, I taught myself how to cook. Uh, potato cakes. Irish potato cakes. And they were down to 18p. Great for breakfasts. 83p after cash, around. after cash back and coupons. We were using the coupons before they went out of date. So I'll be having a lot of tacos. No, I'm just going to the cupboard. They've got a really good shelf date on. I checked um, before picking them up. Drinks. I've got the other two naked smoothies. So should, should end up only costing a pound each. Yeah, so mango machine and green machine. I'm not sure if I'm going to like the green machine, but the mango one, definitely. Um, when we were at Morrison's, because the box was a little bit bashed, the date on this is until next year. This was in the reduced section and it was for 50p. So I spotted that one. We will be keeping this underneath all my almond dream. Keeping on the theme of drinks. We did do four transactions. Yeah. She did two. I did two. But if anyone was going to have to run back in and do a, foot, a third one, I'd have gone and got another one. But yeah. So we have good hemp milk. You've got the dark blue one and this one. I went for the unsweetened one. And they cost me 70p each after coupon. So I won't drink those straight away. <laughs> I saw you giving them to the dog. I won't drink those straight away. They'll go in my seat because they're the long life ones. I will save them for next year because it saves. I knew she was paying a couple of quid for a carton of fresh milk every week. Or a pound at least, so that's it, do a little bit. Come on. Yep. Are we, are we fine with it? No. no. The snacky bits. Hummus pot. With some falafels from Morrison's. She was going to have that for tea, but she realised she had some in the fridge, so she had them. Yeah, use them use up. Them Caramelised onion hummus, 25p. Again, Morrison's. I haven't had this in a long time. Peas pudding. And it was 9p. So I was like, I will have this. I don't know on what, but I will have it. Maybe on a jacket potato. And... She only spotted one and I spotted the second one for her. Tesco's free from coconut milk rice puddings. And I was like, these are mine. And I paid 50p each for both packs. And they should be £2 each. And I would never touch them at £2. So, that is the shopping for the day. Oh, this is Mum's. I got some. As I said, even though it didn't have them online, I found them in the store at 86p. I had the coupons from last month's magazine. So, cost me a grand total of 36p. Yep. So, guess what the dogs are getting their fur bushed in. Yep. So that is our shop in haul for the week. This is... The carbohydrates in this is going to last me a while. So when people ask me, oh, you're not buying carbs or bread... I also buy bread, and she's allowed to nick that as well. Yeah, and as for carbohydrates, we're still going through the pasta that we got for free last year. And my bread this week was even better. I got it for profit. And mum buys a big bag of rice, and the whole household uses that. So when it comes to carbs, because everyone's like, where's the carbs coming from? I know where the veg is, but the carbs, we always have loads in the cupboard. I always have a bag in my rice jar and a bag in the cupboard. And as far as pasta... Don't go there. Don't go there. Okay. Well, right. we will see you ah next week. No, oh, it's the week after. after, so we won't let that know. But we will see you again. Bye. Bye.